Brian, in this video, we're going to uninstall Pro Tools first on a Mac. So I'm going to take you through the entire install process and uh, that's what we're going to do. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do, of course, is to uh, close the program. So I'm going to quit Pro Tools first. Then I don't want to save this project. The next step is to go to the application folders and go to Avid Uninstallers. Double click on Cloud Client Services Uninstaller and then install these two items here. There we go, that's installed. The next step is to go to Avid Link and click on Avid Link Installer, double click. And then we want to install all of these services and it says install finished successfully, quit. The next step is go to the actual application file here and move it to trash. The next step is to go to your hard drive. So Macintosh HD here and go to library and then audio, MIDI patch names and delete Avid here. I'm just gonna go ahead and delete it. Next step is to go to application support here under library, Propeller head software and delete Rex here. Next step is go to Avid, same folder under application support, audio, and, and delete this folder. The next location you want to look at is Macintosh HD. Go to the users, click on your username, and you need to press command, shift, and period to be able to see the hidden files. And then you need to go to library, go to preferences here, Avid. And of course, you want to delete this folder Pro Tools first. So let's do that. And there we go. That's how you install Pro Tools first from your Mac. If you enjoyed this video, then subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. You can also watch these videos, which I think you'd be very interested in. Let me know if you have a question in the comments below and I'll be seeing you in the next video.